We are a dedicated team of hardcore outdoor enthusiasts committed to conserving hunting and fishing traditions. Although technology changes, we still strive to entertain the everyday outdoors. If you like fast-paced, hardcore southern hunting and fishing action, keep up with us and hold on. We are 704 Outdoors. Seven Hundred Four Outdoors TV show is brought to you by Barefoot Archery, North Carolina's leading archery dealer since 1966. Welcome back to another episode of the Seven Hundred Four Outdoors TV show. Thank you guys for joining us again, and we're continuing a awesome deer season. As you've seen, J Bone got it done, and Billy also harvested a nice buck. Now it's my turn to get in the hot seat. And I'm riding out with Jay Bone in one of his places here in Cabarrus County, right on the outside of Harrisburg. And I'm telling you what, it was action from the time we got in the stand. The sun came up we had a fire truck ride by and I tell you there must have been 10 12 15 coyotes fired off and I am jacked up to be able to get one of those off of the property for that landowner he was super excited and I tell you every one of those dirty dogs you get out of the woods you better let that arrow fly all right guys take two second day of opening day we put John Paul back in the stand uh, we'll see what we can do a little windy out here again this hurricane's approaching us i don't think this wind's gonna hurt us at all right now given the fact that this storm's coming up and i'm one of those on the barometric pressure is rising steadily they know something's coming i think he's gonna get it done what do you think john i'd say i'll be down for swinging some more areas where there's a deer uh, <laughs> that was fun this morning heck yeah and uh, we, the big one that I was showing you this morning on my trail cam, he's been more consistent in the evening. So let's hope he shows up. Man. Guys, I'm jacked up. I love deer season. I know y'all are going to love this too. Stick with us.
Looking for the best archery experience? Barefoot Archery in Charlotte should be in your sight. Whether it's backyard recreation, hunting, or 3D competition, we have the right equipment for you. In business since 1966, Barefoot Archery is the authorized dealer in the 704 area for Matthews, Hoyt, PSE, Baron Mission Crossbows, and we have a large selection of recurve bows. Our experienced staff services most compounds and crossbows and can help you make the right choice for your archery equipment. From professional to backyard shooting, Barefoot Archery will get you on target. Barefoot Archery, 4410 Old Pineville Road in Charlotte.
This segment is brought to you by Black Butterfly Ammunition, elegant designs for wicked destruction. This segment is brought to you by Ergo. We don't make guns, we make guns better. Well guys, we have something special to share with you this week. We've got this awesome machine, a species specific feeder, and we've got Harold Monk here to explain a little bit about this awesome machine. Thank you, John. Well, what you have here, this is our four door species specific feeder. And what I mean by species specific, this particular four door machine is set up just to feed white tailed deer. Uh, it has a motion sensor, it has integrated cameras, and it will pick up the animal about 60 feet, uh, try to determine what that animal will be. As it approaches the machine, it can take more characteristics. Uh, it's programmed to look at about 60 different characteristics of a white-tailed deer. Uh, if it fulfills about 85% of that, it will open the door. Um, if you're not a white-tailed deer, the doors will remain closed. Um, one of the features of this machine is you can also tell it if you're not a white-tailed deer and you're an invasive animal like a feral pig or a black bear, um, it will protect itself. It arms itself at about 10,000 volts. This whole machine becomes electrified and as soon as they touch it, I can guarantee you they will not touch it a second time. Personal experience. Personal ex this thing means business. <laughs> um, the, uh, the cameras on here are all integrated so you actually can retrieve your pictures after the deer so it actually keeps the pictures of your white-tailed deer right. so you actually can download those pictures so it becomes a big trail camera. Awesome. And, uh, and now you get to control this from your cell phone. You control it all from your cell phone. And it uh, works off of Wi-Fi so you can pick through what animals you want to feed, what animals you like to electronically charge itself for and, uh, and you can also get your pictures and, and how far. Does that reach the the Wi-Fi on this machine is right close to about 100 feet. Which I mean, normally it's you're a, be a right normal Wi-Fi. Yeah, work you're within. You are the deer stand. You're, you're right. close to it. Um, uh, this particular machine, like I said, is a four-door. This one holds about 250 pounds. Right. There's a six-door that holds all the way up to a thousand pounds. Right. But uh, the uh, the amount of feed that you're actually going to be saving on by not feeding the feral hogs, the bear, the raccoons, all of those yeah. different animals. I mean, this, the machine's gonna pay for itself in no time. It does pretty well. We've been, uh, we've gotten reports from some of the feed companies right. that uh, the food cost is about anywhere from 35 to 40 percent in savings right. for the user to use this machine because right. we're not feeding coons, we're not right. dumping it on the ground, we're not uh, getting it wet, we're not broadcasting it, we're not shooting it 100 feet so everybody can eat it. Yeah. It is only going to feed that animal you would like that to you feed. Would want it to. I tell you what. Well, guys, if you want to get more information about the species-specific feeder, just go to species-specific.org, and you've got all sorts of information. Yeah. Plenty of videos up there yeah. for your entertainment to see bears being shocked. And John, we may put yours up there, <laughs> yeah, with there uh, to show you. Um, <laughs> but uh, it, uh, check out the website. We're always updating it with uh, fresh pictures and pages from uh, other people using the machine. Yep. And follow them on their social media. And keep up with us as we uh, get our hands on this and play with it a little bit. And we're excited to uh, get it in the field, use it, and save a ton of money on some feed. All right. Thanks. Thank you, John. Thank you, sir. You know, this is one of those moments where I should have just kept my mouth shut. So if I was a bear and I decided to grab it, right, that's what's going to pop. What now? So what's char? What's electronically charged? This? That whole... Or this to metal? That whole box. Of this too? 
Yes. So if, so if a bear tries to bite the solar panel, it's charged? Everything on that machine is charged. Yeah, just, just charge that panel and let him... What if I'm like... So guys, this is a species specific feeder and now uh, we have put a bear in front of it and that red light is on meaning that it's electronically charged um, in case a bear wanted to destroy the machine and get inside of it. So if I was a yogi and I wanted to eat some corn and I grabbed a hold of it. Ah! <laughs> <laughs> well now that I got a little pep in my step it's time to get back in the woods. We've got a lot of nice bucks coming in the afternoon, so we headed back out to the same spot where we harvested that coyote early in the morning, and it's time to get after him and see if we can't get it done. This segment is brought to you by 3D Night Vision, the most versatile and affordable clip-on night vision unit on the market. Visit 3dnightvision.com for more details. There's all this talk around town about how great Howl's Pawn and Gun Shop is in Concord, North Carolina. People keep talking about all the different gun manufacturers they carry, like Glock, Springfield, Smith & Wesson, Remington Arms, and so many more. And I hear they have ammo, holsters, stocks and grips, and specialize in gun repairs, modifications, and custom builds. Plus, they have any style of gun, whether it's for sport shooting, hunting guns, or tactical weapons. Howl's Pawn and Gun Shop, 595 Church Street North in Concord, North Carolina. When you like to play in the dark like we do, you need equipment that works. 3D night vision units are lightweight, durable, and versatile. They mount on any daytime rifle scope, field tested, punished, and proven on a wide range of large bore caliber rifles. Coyotes, critters, and wild hogs don't stand a chance. 3D night visions are the most affordable night vision units on the market at only $299. Order yours today at 3dnightvision.com. Closed captioning, courtesy of visitstanley.com.
we followed the blood trail right down this right away cut into the woods right here y'all so we decided to go ahead and double back get the rack packer we looked at the footage we know it's a dead deer so we want to go ahead and just keep on following the blood trail and see if we can't put our hands on them So y'all what, you see all that blood right there? I'm gonna show you that ram cat did some work. There he is guys. There he is right there. Look at the mass on that joke. Key your light. Guys, I am tickled to death with this buck. This is an awesome deer. You know, from the get-go, John told me he had some funky deer in here. It's a management deer. And look at that palmation. He's got four on one side. You see right here? He's got four and then just two on this. And we got a nice deer. This is a mature buck, too. This is actually my biggest bow buck to date. And guys, I can't... I can't give Pearson enough credit. This Ben Pearson recon, man, it just zipped it right through them. And we've got everything on this setup from barefoot archery, the arrows, the ramcat broadheads, the lighted knocks. Telling you what, uh, Jesse down there at Barefoot does a phenomenal job tuning the bows, getting them set up. And you know what? I knew if I anchored right, the bow was going to take care of business. So I tell you what. This one right here, for all the guys down at Barefoot, appreciate it guys. This episode is brought to you by Barefoot Archery, Black Widow Deer Lures, Frosty Bottom Tree Stands, Howl's Pawn and Gun, and Sniper Hog Lights. Thank you to these other contributors.